This is question four. Here we're told that Beth has 600 counters. We're told that three fifths of the counters are yellow, that 25% are red and that the rest are green. We're then told that Beth is given some more red counters and that when she's given more red counters, the ratio of the number of green counters to the number of red counters is one to two. Then we're asked how many red counters was Beth given? So what I'm going to need to do first of all is I just need to work out how many of each counter Beth has at the beginning before these red counters were, were added to the mix. So we're told that Beth has 600 counters and that three fifths of the counters are yellow. So the first thing that we're going to do is work out three fifths of 600. So in order to do that, take 600, divide by 5, that would tell us what 1 fifth would be, and then multiply that by 3. So 600 divided by 5, that's going to give me 120, and then multiply that by 3 for 360. So there are 360 yellow counters. We're then told that 25% of the counters are red. Now, we're going to work out 25% of 600. A couple of different ways that you can do this. You can either say that 25% is one quarter, so work out a quarter of 600 by taking 600 and dividing it by 4. Or you could work out 10% as 60, 20% as 120, and 5% as 30, and add all of those together. Either way, we're going to get 150 as our answer. So we've got 360 yellow, 150 that are red. We're then told that the rest are green. And so that means that we've got how many that are green? 360 plus 150. That's going to give us 510, which means that there are 90 green counters. We're then told that Beth is given some more red counters so that the ratio of the number of green counters to the number of red counters is 1 to 2. So at the moment, we've got green as 90 and red as 150. So the current ratio is 90 to 150. Now, in order to get a ratio of 1 to 2, that means that there needs to be twice as many red counters as there are green counters. So at the moment, well, we've got 90 to 150. We need twice as many as 90. So that means to make the ratio 1 to 2, it would have to be 90 to 180 of green to red. So how many red counters was Beth given to go from having 90 to 150 to 90, 180? Well, what we can say is that we would, needed, we would have needed 30 more red counters. So how many red counters was Beth given? Our answer here is going to be 30.